How do you ensure that migration execution is right the first time? Static and often outdated configuration management database miss application dependencies, slowing down AWS migration. AppDynamics automatically discovers resources, visualize the real-time interactions of every component, and ultimately help you to define move groups quickly. When you successfully define an application's architecture, including application dependencies and inventory, you reduce the risk that a missed interdependency might complicate an AWS migration project or even cause an outage. Before you do anything else, you need to answer three basic questions about your current on-premise architecture. What applications do I need to migrate to AWS and the order? Next is how the applications are related and most importantly, how do I define my move groups quickly? AppDynamics agents can help you to answer these questions. AppDynamics offers agents that supports a variety of languages and development platforms. All you have to do is identify the technology stack to be migrated and instrument the applications with these agents. Once instrumented, with no time, you are presented with this flow map that can identify all the dependencies among applications, external services, web services, databases, and APIs. And this is being built in real time, dynamically, which means that even a new app or endpoint is introduced, the flow map will present in real time. Thus, flow map can help you to understand the upstream and downstream dependencies of your application and provide a starting point to plan your AWS migration. From the flow map, you can also see health of each application. It's simple. Red is bad and green is good. Depending on health, you can prioritize the move. For example, that order processing here is experiencing issues. We may choose to move healthy apps before as we fix the order processing app. If you take a closer look, it is easy to find that apps like Wear Services session services and policy services have no downstream dependencies and they are healthy. So these apps can be my first move group to start the migration. Likewise, you can define rest of the move groups based on dependency and health of your apps. Before we start moving these groups, it is essential to know how the applications are deployed. Node and tier view let you determine the application topology like cluster size, load balancer requirements, and binaries. Like you can see, the account management application, it runs on three nodes, and it has Java binaries installed. Eventually, this will serve as an inventory throughout the migration of different move groups. The inventory will help you to set up and size AWS infrastructure accordingly. This is how AppDynamics can help you to discover applications along with their dependencies and by doing so, it finds you a quicker way of defining the move groups.